Hi guys, it's Janet. Welcome back to my channel. What I want to share with you guys today is a video about the hunt for planters. Uh, so my last video or a couple videos before I shared my plant home tour and I am very particular about the planters I wanted. I searched high and low. It took me weeks maybe even months to find them all. But I felt like it was kind of hard to find some online so I thought I'd share the video. I know some people asked me where I got them and I'd share where I got them and some links below for you guys. So I'm only gonna show a few of my favorites. I have like probably 20 plants or more. I will link that video below my plant home tour so you can check it out if you haven't. But let's get started on the planters. Is that what they're called, planters? My house is mostly white and gold and like rose gold, so I wanted a bunch of white and gold planters, which would make sense. And uh, I'm gonna start with Target. So I, I usually do my hauls based on stores, that way I can link below like in an order. Uh, the first planter I'm gonna share, and I think they still probably have it, is this one from Target. This one is really cute and sturdy, and I leave my plants in the like little planters they come in. And then I just put them in decorative planters. I don't plant them in like the these planters. The reason I do that is most of the like really pretty planters don't have holes in the bottom of them. And so your plant is successful, you need to have holes at the bottom of the planter so when you water it, it can like leak through the bottom instead of like sit in water and rot. So anyway, um, just I share that with you guys. The next planter, which I totally love, is also from Target and it's this guy. Um, it's I think Project 62 is the brand. I think it was like $30 as well. Um, I did spend kind of a lot of money on planters, but I feel like my house is decorated a certain way and I just wanted really pretty planters, but you can like find cheaper ones other places probably. But I didn't think $30 was too bad because I saw some of these at like West Elm for like double in price, but anyway. Um, I think this one's still available, so I'll link it below. And the next guy is really big. Um, I meant to buy a smaller version of this and I accidentally bought this big one because I bought it online. Also from Target, and I think um, this one is the same brand as the first one I showed you, but it's a very large. Uh, if you watch my plant tour video, you'll see like how I styled all the plants and where I put the planters. But this one, um, I think was like $60, but I got it on sale also. So Target will have these crazy sales where they do like 30% off home and um, home decor. So just wait for a sale. Okay, moving on to the next store. I went to, I'm looking around, I went to Walmart. I found the cutest planters ever. They got a marble in my house, so I bought two planters from Walmart. I just ran in there for something and I looked at planters and found um, these. This is one of them. And they were super inexpensive. Um, I mean, I think this was like $5, honestly. And then here's another one. So I already have a, I took most of the plants out, but some of them I haven't taken out. Uh, this is the other one, and it's like a marble design, and this one was probably like $9 or something. I took the plant out. They look really expensive, but they're very inexpensive, so you just really never know where you're going to find like super cute planters. If you're on the hunt, just keep an eye peeled. I will say that... Um, I don't see that many anymore, but it was mostly like in spring and summer that they had a lot of them right now. It's like turning into fall decor already. So you might have some trouble finding some, but I'll definitely link all the ones that I have that I can for you below. Okay, so moving on to the next store is called At Home. And I don't know if you can buy online at that store, so I'm just gonna show you the two that I got there. I actually got um, two of this one. So it's also the marble print and I just love the marble print. Um, I am not over the marble print yet. I bought two of these and I put them in um, my daughter's bathroom. These were, were $7.99 so very inexpensive as well. And then the one behind me is also from at home. Um, this guy right here. This one is also from at home. This is the bottom part of it and this is Theo. Uh, he's one of my plant babies that lives in this planter and it came with like a little stand so here's the stand I don't know if you guys can see I'm trying to like 
get it in the frame right here for you guys. But I love this one. This one was only $50 at the store at home. I haven't been to that store in a while, so I'm not sure if they still have them. If they do, they're probably on clearance now. Moving on to the next store is CB2. Uh, I like CB2. It's kind of like a little modern, but they have some really cute stuff. So I found a couple of planters that I'm gonna share with you there. They actually have a lot of large ones. It's kind of pricey, but the ones I bought were very inexpensive and I'll show you what they look like. Here's the first one from CB2. It's really tiny. It's white with like gold marble on it. They have this they have this planter in several sizes. I just bought the smallest one they had um, because um, I needed it for my little aloe plant in my bedroom. So this is what it looks like when the plant is in there. Next planter from CB2 is also like a, a little bit darker gold in color. So it's this one. It kind of reminds me of a pineapple, honestly. They also had this uh, planter in a couple of different sizes, but this one was really inexpensive at CB2 and super cute. So I totally recommend going to World Market. I found so many planters there. Um, and I actually bought several of these in all different sizes for my house because my, like I said, my house is gold. Here's one of them and they have this same color in a little bit smaller and um, I think this is the largest size they have but um, looking at the price it was only $7.99 and uh, I actually this is a new plant I didn't talk about in my last video but I got a couple new plants last weekend so I'll have to do an updated plant tour for you guys but love these world market super cute super cheap. This is the next planter from World Market. I bought two of these and I actually spray painted uh, this rose gold for my kitchen. And um, I think it's really cute, but it comes apart. It comes apart like this. So that's why I was able to spray paint it. So if you needed it to be a different color, you could spray paint it, you know, like I did rose gold. And then this is also a new baby I had to get last weekend. Sebastian Jr. That's his name. I also went into Home Goods. I totally recommend going to Home Goods and looking at it. You can get really lucky. I got this planter at Home Goods for only like $20 and I think it's super cute, really pretty gold. Uh, definitely looks more expensive than $20. So just like I said, keep looking around and you're going to get lucky. The last planner I want to share with you guys is from an online store that I bought. Um, I found, I think Sean was looking at couches actually, but it's called Article and this planter is so gorgeous and so large. It's for one of my like bigger plants. And this is it. It's kind of like a gold dented kind, um, it's gold and dented and it's really large. This planter was like $100, but a couple of times a year, the store will have a sale where uh, they go down to like, I think $69. They also have this in different sizes. So they have a smaller version that I wanna get. I just, I'm waiting for the sale to come around again. And they have some other versions, but I'll definitely link it below. because. I that's all the planners I have to share with you guys today. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do below. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.